somebody wanted me to make a tutorial on uh, how I done my intro the other day so I'm gonna do a piece of it here uh, you need to make a video track then uh, insert text media write whatever you want to then uh, pick the font you want to use uh, this is a good one the dirty ego font from uh, a thousand and one fonts and I'll put the link in the sidebar uh, set it about 108 Outline it with uh, a green, maybe. This is just the way I've done it. You can do it however you want to. I'm just giving you the idea. Uh, set your text all the way down. And that's basically the simplest way I can do it and have it look decent. You can also mess around with these, and it kind of helps a little bit. It kind of gives a different look, you know. And then uh, also, somebody asked about the blinking text. Uh, You need to set your keyframes. Okay, set a keyframe there, and then turn this all the way up, back to light. Then set another keyframe, turn this all the way down. Another keyframe, turn this back up. Keyframe, back down. Keyframe, back up. Keyframe, down. Keyframe, back up keyframe down. Now keep in mind I'm showing you the simplest way to do all this so I know there's going to be people that say there's an easier way to like copy and paste or whatever but I'm not going to try to get into that today. Just try to just do it in the simplest way possible. Okay. And there's what you end up with. somebody else asked about the flashing background and that would kind of be done the same way just instead of using the text you'll use the background so you know you just we'll set another Okay, I'm going to show you how to do a uh, light ray effect on your text. Let's see. Insert a video track. Insert two video tracks. Uh, text media. Do this in the second track. Put whatever you want to in the text. You just use whatever font you want to use. It doesn't really matter on this. I'll use something everybody's got an Im impact. Uh, everybody's usually got an impact. Okay, turn the bolt off. Outline with white. Feather down. With down. Text off. Turn your width up just a little bit so you can see it better.
text. Set your bound radius off. Leave it off. Your strength and everything, you can set that how you need it. Uh, looks pretty good like that. And then you can gradually see how it works. And it'll take a bunch of tweaking to get the everything how you want it and how it looks the best. Feather up, feather down. The blend. The noise makes it, noise kind of makes it sparkle a little bit. Uh, our strength's about halfway on this. Uh, sensitivity. I'm going to bring it down. Okay, then you just set your keyframes. You just got one keyframe there, you move it this way. Keyframe there, move it a little bit more. Keyframe there, move it a little bit more. Keyframe there, move it back a little bit more. Keyframe there, move it back this way a little bit more. Keyframe. Keyframe. And you can set these however you want to. There's no you can do it up and down, you can do it sideways, you can do it like this, you can do it like that. I'm just kinda giving you a basic thing to do. And then set one more keyframe for it to stop on. That in the middle. Okay. There's a basic light ray effect on your text. If you wanted to color them, then you would just come down here and hit color, you know, and uh, I'll color your rays. how done that and you just kind of anybody has any questions or if I move too fast or didn't you know it should be pretty simple for everybody it's fairly basic stuff it's easy to do but it doesn't look half bad for some people you know when you're starting out so just uh, message me on here or something or I'll leave an email contact stuff in the sidebar I'll leave the font uh, links to the fonts in the sidebar too and I'll have some tutorials on how to put those in Sony Vegas, how to put the fonts in Sony Vegas, and some different stuff on that, and some more in-depth tutorials on like the alien effect and the phantom effect and stuff like that coming up pretty soon. So 